guys, myself Dr. Akshay Kumar, MD Pediatrics. Just completed my uh, post graduation from Mohan Azhar Medical College. I am here to share my views about uh, pediatric residencies to clear away all your doubts regarding uh, why to join the branch, why to join the branch, and what can what and all you could expect uh, in the, these three years of residency uh, in field of pediatrics. Why pediatrics? Uh, why would one join pediatrics? Uh, as uh, you know, that children are not just small adults; they vary from adults in their anatomy, physiology, pharmacokinetics, dynamics and uh, how they respond to therapy and it varies largely from between children to children. So it's uh, uh, entirely a separate branch. Uh, people who like medicine and uh, don't like much of adults are, can opt to pediatrics and those who like to be surrounded by children and uh, mind you also can bear with that tantrums at the orders hours, uh, pediatrics is for you. Uh, this give, it's a very rewarding branch, gives a lot of satisfaction and uh, it, you will never regret taking pediatrics if you fill up. Regarding the pros and cons. Uh, the list of pros and cons varies between individual to individual and each one has to make its own regarding the branch and the college one you must stop. In regarding pediatrics, uh, the pros are uh, it's more satisfying branch and uh, gives a lot of uh, happiness during work and uh, it's all more, more of a pros only. And regarding cons, uh, that's no uh, such specific uh, disadvantage but uh, uh, it's a very responsible branch you have to like any other branch in medicine but uh, uh, it you have to be on your toes uh, and uh, take uh, own, own your own mistakes and learn from them and be re responsible for them. Regarding scope, uh, pediatrics is evergreen branch and uh, it will be in demand till eternity and uh, there is no down going to it. And uh, regarding the stipend, this depends on the state to state. Uh, the maximum stipend one would expect would be in Delhi and there is no bond also. So it would be the first choice but depends on your person to person. And uh, rest uh, in southern states, the stipend is a bit less and there is bond also. So but if there is a native of that place, that time one could opt for it. Uh, so it's a personal decision, depends on, uh, varies from person to person. And uh, uh, regarding the need for super speciality in pediatrics, in the second and third tier cities, uh, the uh, requirement for super specialist uh, in pediatrics branch as such is not uh, that much and uh, it's not required. Uh, but in the metropolitan cities, uh, there are uh, many super specialists in the pediatric branch and the, the demand is rising for them. And if one wishes to uh, want to uh, settle down in a metropolitan city, uh, one would opt for uh, a super specialty. The other super specialty branches are the major chunk would be neonatology, neonatology, other are pediatric gastroenterology, pediatric neurology, pediatric cardiology, uh, developmental pediatrics and uh, a few more uh, endocrinal, uh, pediatric endocrinology and a few more booming branches are coming on. Uh, what would be the work routine of a uh, resident doing this residency in pediatrics? Uh, the first year as usual at, as, as any residence would be very hectic. Like, yet, yet in pediatrics there are uh, fixed hours, there is uh, not inhumane working hours uh, in most of the colleges but still it depends on college to college. Uh, first year is more of a practical work, one would learn the uh, most uh, important skill which is the cannulation and uh, lumbar puncture and other day-to-day uh, -day routine uh, practices and uh, basic skills. And uh, during these three years of residency, uh, if done from a very good college, one would learn procedures like uh, liver biopsy, kidney biopsy, ICD uh, placement and uh, uh, endotracheal intubation which is the most important one. And this, are, this may sums up the most important skills one must or ought to learn during the residency. And uh, as you become second year, third year, though the uh, skill work is uh, uh, learned, uh, then the academic work uh, burden comes on you and you tend more to learn from the books and prepare for your examinations.